I hope you enjoy this great little day out in the lakes with the more than capable 28 gauge. It was a fantastic shooting day, icy cold but sunny, with a gentle breeze but very tricky underfoot, and in some parts very tricky to get to, all down to the weather conditions of course. And as everyone knows, high bird shooting can sometimes be hard going, especially in the depths of winter. But we managed to get to our pegs safely, thanks to the wonderful horse of Lingholm. The camera struggled on a couple of drives to manoeuvre onto birds I was shooting at because of the icy slope in peg positions. Here we are today, folks. We're at the the pheasant at, within the Lake District, aren't we, Vic? We are that. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. you used to be a regular visitor, didn't you? Yeah. Many months North, ago. North Lakes. Yeah. Well, I'm with an old porsche called Victor, who, who comes with Ian Ferry, one of our shooting buddies, and uh, he a back shot himself. <laughs> but what kind of day are we going to have today the, on these uh, well, Lake District pheasants? It should be nice. Nice day. It yeah. Go well. Lovely day. No, yeah. you can't. But wind is an excuse, <laughs> can you? It's, and, it's an absolute perfect shooting day, isn't it? Lovely day. No fog. Just uh, every every tree is absolutely frozen. It's a proper Christmassy shooting day. Most of you have been here before. Special welcome to new, uh, some new faces. But live on our pegs, and Ollie will blow the horn to say that's the end of the drive. Uh, pheasants and partridge today. It's a small board day, so that should be fun. Apparently, Steve's a top shot, so we'll be keeping a special eye on that. Come back here and shoot through at the end of the day. So, unless anybody's got any questions, we're somewhere near, I think. And I'll be watching very closely with the lights back when we really start blowing any up. Okay. <laughs> 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 You've got a reputation for this to keep up. You've got a lifetime. Well, it's a change from shooting the highest one, isn't it, Stuart? He did wipe my eye once, you know. Oh, yeah. 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 We've got it on film. Yeah. <laughs> We've never heard the end of it. Never. <laughs> Fantastic backdrop, and in a minute you'll, you'll see these vehicles, uh, all four-wheel drive, trying to get up this hill. These are very, very steep bankings, and uh, but what, a, what a beautiful, picturesque place. One of my favourite spots to come is the Lake District, and this beautiful shooting estate, Lingholm. <coughs> what a place to be. But just let's, uh, let's have a minute watching these vehicles trying to get up this track. There's one coming up now. He's struggling. When he gets here. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> it's a twenty eight board day, one of our small board days. This is my third one out and shooting the, uh, the Game Boy Regals, a 25 gram fibre, and shooting a borrowed um, 525, which I'm waiting for Brownie to send me one. I've no doubt it'll be in the post, but uh, um, this will be based on the 525 chassis. Very trustworthy chassis. <coughs> and uh, as it's a pure 28 bore chassis, we do get uh, guns that that come in 20 bars that will swap into a 28 bars but I prefer the the straight 28 bar chassis uh, I don't like to shoot a small bar on a on a big bar uh, uh, chassis so but let's see how we get on
well done. Cheers, buddy. Well, I, I did get tier three partridge and I think I got four nice pheasants, one particular very good one, so quite happy with the uh, the game boy 28 gauge uh, fives are uh, shooting. It's just a pleasure to be here. It's not just about the shooting. I mean, this backdrop we've got here is second to none. And uh, any any of our overseas visitors ever get chance to you know to get to the UK and and and, and need to you know go to some really nice places, check the Lake District because it, it's a beautiful place. You know, if you, even if you're not coming shooting or or anything, just to just to come round here and just walk and have a nice week. You know touring round, it's a spectacular views and I think you'll go home very, very happy. How long have you been uh, picking up with these dogs? I've, well, I've had one, this is like the third. Yeah. So I've, I've had them for like maybe 10 years yeah. or something like that. And I what, do a lot of stalking. Yeah, but you prefer springers for picking up, these yeah. for deer stalking. Yeah, and beating so, hard, yeah. yeah. So every every dog's got its job really it does, in the countryside. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Anyway, thanks very much for your very time nice. and right. keep the good work up. Right. Well, and that's this is what I call well the first drive a cigar drive, but <laughs> I don't usually smoke, but uh, I, I keep ramping on about uh, the Lake District. But every time I come here, I think it's the place that we could call home forever. It's such a fantastic vista and a fantastic, you know, a fantastic place to come and have a day out. Uh, as I say, I don't smoke, but it's deserving of a cigar, mate. I second and, that, David. And well, well shot on the first drive. You too, as well. Mm. That's a few nice ones between us. Very, very uh, tricky drive that because the birds sort of they came to my right, to my left. Very few came down the centre, but to my left, I was just hampered with this tree a little bit. I had to wait while they passed the tree, and they were very difficult birds then. But we, we got one or two nice ones. Thanks very much, no, shit, David. Got, got some good ones there. Yeah, fantastic yeah. showing of birds yeah, here, good. Well, mate. Yeah, no, good. Very yeah, good. good. Yeah, Ollie be pleased. You still got plenty of stock on. Yeah, oh, yeah. I'm just going to ask you a personal question. You can, quietly. Are you, no. below, are you below 50? No. So I'm what? not. I'm 60 next year. Are you? Want to bloody know hell. That. Right. You yeah. can get up these hills well. I You're can. bloody well done anyway. <laughs> Brilliant. We've got no alternative to go out this way because the, the road is that polished and with ice on the other side, we won't get down it safely. So, it's a very tricky situation at the moment.
See this chap walking up now, he used to be one of the best shots in England, you know, but he's, he's gone downhill fast. I don't know what it is. Have you, uh, have you been poorly? Old We're just telling him how good a shot you used to be. <laughs> Never. And uh, these last two or three years, you've suddenly you've gone down a little Dropped bit. off a cliff. Yeah. I no, know when I, when I get excited of him, he usually perks up a little bit, you know, he's, gets him going a little bit. Well done, mate. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> You're not dead yet. <laughs> This is uh, David's wood. David's wood, yeah. I'm going to try and fetch him out of here. Yeah. I'll give it a go. Well, and I'll, I'll hey, explain Mike. who David hey, Wood is. What a fantastic well, we're day trying so it. Far. We're trying hard anyway. It's been brilliant, we're trying I've hard. enjoyed it. Still yeah. conditions are tricky. Yeah. But uh, you've yeah. seen a bit of it. You've yeah, seen but, it. You've hey, had a taste of it. So far, so good, mate. Nice finish, some stonking birds in. Just shot some nice ones uh, to my left there. Uh, got a bit of uh, RF maneuvers going off here. Look at that one there, Johnny. I'll get him on now. Yeah. Great to see the lads out enjoying themselves in the sky, look. Hey, thanks very much for uh, yeah, no, carrying me bags, mate. I've yeah, struggled, struggled along today with the old knee, but we're getting there, mate. What more, more can I say? Lingholm is for me is a fantastic place to come and shoot, and a nice day to come and have a yeah, just to, just to have a have a have a ride round and have a walk round. It's such a pretty place. Well, hey, thanks very much, lads. It's been a great day, fantastic team, and some fantastic shooting. Hopefully we'll let we'll to shoot with you again if you'll accept my humble apologise for shooting one of Burns' birds. But he did get his own back with half a dozen of mine. <laughs> uh, well done anyway, lads. Fantastic. Day. Hey.